So for those of you all who are tuning in right now, my name is Hector Dominguez. I am a, uh, a rapper from the Chicagoland area. I've been playing guitar for around one year now. I am an artist. I'm a filmmaker. I started off as actress, television personality, and then recently have kind of become more involved in production. By using the medium of guitar, I can spread them that message by bringing people together, dwell in each other's company, and dwell in the music at the same time. I'm an artist. Producer. I started an initiative called Paint the City, where my partner and I, Missy Perkins, literally go around painting the city. I'm really passionate about working with youth, so that inspired me to form Civic Studio. We are a creative studio, and we produce content um, that has a positive impact on the community. So music transcends culture, race. So I just love using it to convey a message. I definitely want to be that agent of change. Right now, it's recording. Okay. <laughs> My name is Valerie Biondi, and I was born and raised in Chicago. And our business is devoted to creating art that benefits the community. So it's led by a team of, you know, industry professional artists. And then we have a team of youth that acts as our creative team and they help to produce um, content that helps the community. My name is Keith Lee. I started an initiative called Paint the City, connecting local artists to local businesses, maybe using the heart, and the facial expressions that express you know, love, passion. Our mission is to heal the city through art. Art heal. Say so you can't if you can't not spill heart without art. I'm Ryan Rosilas. I've been playing guitar for around one year now. I spread messages of peace and love through performing music. It causes like tranquility to arise in people, you know? It's a really peaceful maybe thing to like, do. Get in there, it should dance, maybe talk, you know, um, a social aspect like that. Culture doesn't have a color. Someone cannot be my ethnicity, but share the same cultural values as I do. That's when I realized it's not a really a color thing, it's more of a culture thing. So within that, you know, that's where unity comes to mind for me because unity is people who are able to share the same beliefs, values. One of the main ingredients of unity is loyalty, and loyalty is when people have your back even when you're not looking. I feel like this is where I'm supposed to give like the dictionary, right? Unity, everyone comes together and loves each other. During these riots that've been happening in Humble Park and the Lawndale community and Inglewood and all that, unity would mean how can I, who is not immediately affected by that specific situation, but feeling the effects of it, how can I help you? And to me, just being there, like to me, that's unity. Like we might not always agree on everything, we might not always see things the exact same way, but at the end of the day, if, like the Bible says, if I ain't got love, I ain't got nothing. This is my son, Junior. Obviously, he's a different color than I am. He's got to learn how to move through that, navigate through that, and the only way to do that is by modeling that. So if I'm, I can't preach, hey, we got to love everybody, be nice to everybody, respect everybody, and I'm, I'm not doing that. For me, there's nothing quite as unifying as playing a song in front of your friends probably in front of a concert in front of many people and just have them all come together and sing along I need this especially in the climate of our world currently where there's such a division on every type of subject there is we need less division in this world a more unification whenever you decide to jump off that cliff and like and separate yourself, you're gonna get pushback from everybody. And I do mean everybody. People that you love, people who you'll read close with, because they just don't understand it. Because, you know, it's not their vision, it's your vision. So you gotta just really own your vision. Accept the fact that you might be broke for two, three, 10 years doing it. <laughs> this is my 11th year being an artist. And for 10 years, I went back and forth being broke and having a lot of money, having no money. Have a lot and just, just up and down. 
can do anything your mind sets out to do. You can become a filmmaker, you can become an artist. As long as you have the drive and motivation to do something, don't let money be an obstacle. Don't let people be an obstacle. Just propel yourself forward and eventually everything will work out. I think there's really something to say about following your dreams. I, I've been on television, I had my time to shine. Now it's the youth's time to shine. It's my time to actually pass my talent and create future leaders. So that's my goal. My name is Valerie Biondi and this is how I represent Peace and Love. I'm Ryan Rasulis, and this is how I represent peace and love. I want to thank you guys for hanging out with me, man. And just to be super clear, my name is Hector Dominguez, and this is how I show peace and love. My name is Eric Heathley, and this is how I represent peace and love.